Yes, hello. Are you joining me for this interrogation of the suspect? Yes. All right. Hello, Mr. Pitkin. Hello, Mr. Blinkhorn. Hello, Mr. Garrow. Get out. Now. Please escort this suspect for interrogation. Now. Hmm? A good day to you. Okay. My name is Sherlock Holmes. I'm assisting the police with their investigation of the murder of Sir Rodney Bentcliffe. Would you mind if I asked you a few questions? Ah, uh, 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 I am Tristram Garrow. Tristram? Really? Is that a name? Cool. A real name. I thought it was just uh, a town in Diablo. Anyway, you remind me of one of the hobbits. <laughs> you uh, don't look so good. You appear to be a little sweaty. And uh, very stressed. Shock? Is it a shock? Or is it something else? We shall find out soon enough. When I'm done talking to myself. Your profession. What is your occupation? I, I am a councillor at the uh, district chamber. And what were you doing at the bar? I don't believe you. Well, I, I follow the researches. I am uh, I interested in, in archaeology. Mm -hmm. You follow them? Yes. So many things happened and w we need to know. Or perhaps it's better hidden. I beg your pardon, Mr. Garrow. I, uh, I, I meant nothing, but by that I, I apologize. Really? You really don't know how to handle yourself in this situation, do you? <laughs> I can use that to my advantage. Or perhaps it is to my disadvantage, because you have nothing to hide and you are just very, very stressful. Mm. Uh, Sir Rodney. What was it like to work with Sir Rodney? Yes. It was like... Uh, Working with, with a genius. With an asshole. He was a hard man. Yes. But then, you, you know, this world is hard. Very. There are always people who want to steal from you. Indeed. Yeah. He, uh, he trusted me, but, uh, oh. Are you feeling unwell? <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> it is I. Oh, I remember. Oh, I, I feel so sorry. Do you need anything? I, uh, I, I, I feel bad. I, uh, I, I hear. No, nothing. I, I, I I'm better now. You hear, oh yes, you hear voices, don't you? Hmm. And you have visions. Uh, huh. Okay, well. The murder. Please try to recall what you saw today. I'm getting impatient. so, so hot, I, I had to remove my glasses. I was not feeling so very well. Oh, you did there. that. Oh. But you found the body. I saw the knife, you know. Knife? Flying through the air, I, I, I what? saw the blood. <laughs> I tried to escape. I, I don't remember. Saw the knife. What did it look Flying like? Flying through the Everything air? Everything was as if I in a nightmare. It all happened so fast. The knife was, was shining like, like gold. Uh, oh, hold on. A knife flying through the air and into Bentcliffe's eye. Really? Is that your... Okay. Well, there are a number of things wrong with that. Uh, first of all, and most important of all, um, you couldn't see shit, basically, <laughs> because of the steam. So you couldn't have seen a knife flying around, even if it was golden, as you say. And, well, second, there is no knife to be found anywhere. So I think that was one of your visions, or you went Psycho, and you just made that up while you were killing him. Had Sir Rodney exhibited any recent strange behavior? Well, he, he had been rather secretive these past few days. Last Thursday, for, for example, I, I saw him leave. When he returned, it, it was very late. He showed me some wet coins, Roman coins. Disgusting. And, uh, he started to laugh. Wet coins. <laughs> that usually cracks me up as well, especially wet Roman coins. I mean, <laughs> I mean, I mean, it's, it's hilarious uh, it's, that you mention it now. I mean, it's ridiculous. It's it's very funny. Thank you. That was uh, enjoyable. 
His ring. Oh, it should be destroyed. Excuse me? Why do you say that? It is a cursed ring. Of course. Digging dark secrets. Really? I... Uh, it is after me now. I know it. Uh, I shouldn't have worked on it in the workshop. It's too late now. Okay. Flying knife. Cursed ring. Interesting. If it is a cursed ring, then it is not a very good idea to have it repaired and, well, that badly. So, yeah, that might be a problem. This is the coin that, that he showed me. It is from the third century. It must be very rare. Yes. No, I, 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 I don't know. Oh. Okay. Yes. No, I don't know. Drug. There you go. Thank you. Thank you. This will help me to calm down. Do be careful with the dosage. I, I will. I mean it. Just give me an hour and I'll be fine. <laughs> Champagne. Did you place the bottle of it was you, wasn't in the changing room? What? No. Oh. So it was Bentcliff. Or you're lying. Or the others are lying. You're all lying. I'm going to have you all killed. <laughs> okay. <laughs> um, eye bags. Get your new eye bags. Only 500 pounds. Badly shaven. No, oh, man, he's just being trendy. What's this? Perspiration. Yes. Sweaty motherfucker. Hmm. Do you really do look like a hobbit? Uh. Dirty clothes. Dirty! You're dirty! Hey! I know that amulet, actually. Garrow appears to be rather mentally disturbed. Either that, or he is a good actor. Or both. Hmm. The uh, hand amulet, yeah, I, I actually know that one personally. Uh, cool. Okay, well, B, then. Uh, strange wounds, Garrow's drug. Broken glasses. Uh, uh, nope. Why would Sir Rodney be hiding anything? Could his discovery be the motive for the crime? What? The last expedition. Find out where Sir Rodney was several days before his murder and uncover his precious secrets. I guess we will have to do that. Yeah. What important discovery was Sir Rodney about to make? Yeah. Mm -hmm. now, if only we had a necromancer, so we could just ask Rodney himself. But. Hmm. Okay. Mm, did I do everything else? Really? I don't think so. Nope, I think we checked everything. For now. So, next step is... Um, opening this door for no reason because I'm in charge no I'm not but uh, feels like it when I open this door and this one open the door like I just don't care open the it's open locked open locked I want it to be open locked open sesame locked Open says you. Locked. Watson, are you still down there? 
He wasn't even with me in the interrogation room. Hm. Strange. Can I talk to these guys? Do you have something else to ask me? Yes. Why are you such an arrogant prick? I'm trying to rest. I'm not sure that I can be helpful at the moment. Hmm. All right then. Lestrade. You better not be busying yourself with another damn facelift. Wasting time. You still look funny. Stairs come. Stairs come. Mr. Holmes. <laughs> yes. Yo. Mr. Holmes. You two better not screw things up. Still with the leg on the bench. Damn it. Some people never learn. Policeman. Mr. Holmes. Okay. So, let me see. I wanna. Hmm. I need to go back here, regardless. But first, Scotland Yard. No, I'm already at Scotland Yard. <laughs> Do. First, Baker Street. Ah, I see you magically teleported back in here. And you are rubbing your knee against mine once more. You have anything to say for yourself, Watson? Or are you going to be quiet as a mouse? I do actually enjoy you being quiet. Ah, it's good to be home. Uh, has anything changed in here? I guess not. Letters? This is where I keep my post. Post. Yes, indeed. Search for Sir Bentcliffe. Interesting. I will remember that. Um, first, I want to do something else. Uh, yes, yes, yes. Fine, fine, fine. I'll do that later. On the sofa for the third time today. Well, don't be surprised if Watson sits on you again. Stupid dog. Okay. Uh, are you looking at my precious gem outside there? I mean... Um, is she there anyway? Uh, yep, she's there. Watson, I knew what you were doing. What should we do next, Holmes? Whatever you feel like. Okay. Uh, 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 let's get over there. Ooh, look at all that. Uh, analyze dirt, analyze blood, analyze metal, examine. Hmm. 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 Analyze dirt. That's it, that's it, that's it. What am I supposed to do this time? Uh, dirt sample. Oh, okay, cool. Selenite. Selenite. Yes, I said that. Oh, there's more. Okay. Uh, pyrites or pyrites? Pyrite. Pyrite, oh. otherwise known as fool's gold. Hmm. White clay particles. White clay particles. Yes. Interesting. According to the color and its composition, I deduce that this sample is white clay. Now, I need to find which area near London this sample belongs to. Uh, okay, so white London clay, just click here then. 
Cool. The sample of dirt belongs to the White London Clay region, located near the city of St. Albans. Do you have a list of this? Man, that's cool. Uh -huh. A hand-drawn map found among Sir Rodney's belongings it points to a location around St. Albans to the north of London. It can be found on the map at Baker Street. Ah, so the map has, is useful for something. Uh, yeah. Analyze blood. Nothing else we can do? All right. Let us analyze this blood sample. Let's. This blood has not coagulated well. It seems very liquid. That is strange. Let us see what is inside mm. it. Hydrogen peroxide will bring any foreign matter to the surface. I oh, must take okay. a pipette and place several drops of hydrogen peroxide. Oh, oh, sorry. Uh, a pipette, yes, of course. Uh, oh, this is pretty cool, actually. Let's put it in acid. No. Mm -hmm. Okay. I assume you know what you're doing. Oh. Huh. Right. Water. This blood is heavily diluted with water. Steam? Uh. Um, very liquid blood. The blood around the victim was highly diluted with water. Strange wound. Steam moisture. The presence of water is due to humid atmosphere caused by the steam. Unexplained clue. The presence of water in the blood is an unexplained clue. It must be somehow linked to the murder process. Let's do the first one first. I'm keeping this on Blinkhorn's interest for now. And this on this one for now. Uh, yeah. Okay, all that is done. Uh -huh. Okay. Can I do anything with this metal, really? This is a piece of metal taken from a brazier. Right, it right. appears to be silver, but I need to be sure. If it is silver, it will be possible to melt it, since silver's melting point is at around 900 degrees Celsius. Let us compare this sample with a silver penny by testing it with acid. If it changes color cool. to match the result of a reaction with a silver coin, then it is silver. I must take a pipette and ah. place several drops of acid upon the samples. A pipette. Fine. There you go. Wow, okay. Aha! The reaction is the same red stain. It is silver. Britannia silver quality. Okay, so B. Inside brazier. Britannia silver is found melted in the brazier. Um, nah, I don't think I can do this with any. What? I can, of course. The glasses. Possible silver weapon. An item of silver has been recently melted in the brazier. Okay. Just trying everything else. All right. My analysis table. It is useful for my work. For once, it has been really, really, really useful. Yes. Indeed. Um, 
So I need to look at the map. First, I want to go back to Strand Lane and look around. anything happened here? Mr. Holmes. Wow, that's a lot. All these events are bad for the baths. And my job. Still are. Um, let's look around. Champagne bottle. The light thingy. The blood thingy. The light thingy. The glasses thingy, the steam thingy. Hey, you're on duty, you know. You're not supposed to just enjoy this steam room. Where are the suspects? They are not here anymore. So why are you? Mr. Holmes? That is not a very good answer. I want a good answer and you better prefer it now! Mr. Holmes? Alright, well, I understand. Enjoy, man. See you later. Okay. Well, that didn't give me much change at all. Uh, no. Yo. What should we do next, Holmes? Ah, oh, watch me. Yeah. No, I can't continue here at all, can I? Uh -huh, uh -huh. I can't find anything. Fallen blocks, that's all. All right. Going back, we're going to... This area serves a... This area. Yes, I know. I just want to look into it again. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Table. Yes, it's a table. Hmm. The things you learn when doing police work. Uh, shelves. Shelves, shelves. Okay, well, nothing new. <laughs> So, we could go to the place that was indicated on the map. But we will do so. <laughs> well, you know what I'm going to say. Poop face! Ha, huh, didn't expect that, did you? We will look into it next time. Bye-bye.